Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty and I am working on my red and black series. So today I am working on an let's see, a 9 by 12 canvas. I already have my base paint down because I'm going to do a Dutch pour with just red and black. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Um, I am using Soho Brilliant Red. and Creative Inspirations Lamp Black. Okay, so I am going to start by, I'm not really sure how to do this because it is only, you know, it's basically only one color, so which is the red. So I think I'm going to just pour, I think I want to pour a puddle of black and then I'll put white on it. I mean red. So I think I'll go right about here. Do that. <clears throat> And then I will pour my red right there. Um, then, I know, right? There's more. There's always more. Then I'm going to try to carefully put my other black around it. This is my base paint. And I'm kind of wanting to use that up because I've had it for a little bit. So um, I think I'm going to put a dot of black in there. Why? I don't know. Let's, let's just check it out. See what it does. Okay. So this is the fun part and the messy part. So I'm going to turn on my hair dryer and I'm going to blow the paint over and then back that way. I'm going to try it on low first, so it might get loud. There. I do not have silicone in any of my paints. I've mixed them um, one part paint, two parts Floetrol, and a little bit of water to get it to the consistency that I like. So I'm going to blow it back that way. And I don't think low is going to do it. I'm going to try to, I don't know, I'm going to try. But I think I might have to do it on high. So here we go. Well, I'm actually seeing what you guys see. There's not really, it's so dark. And it just doesn't seem to be, maybe I'll put some more red in here. Torch it down, get all the bubbles out. Yeah, I think I'm going to put some more red. Because I really want the red to show. Um, 
Yeah. I'm thinking. Yeah, I'm going to put some more red here. And then this time, I'm only going to put just a little bit of black. Um, just a little bit. Alright, I'm going to blow it again, you guys. airbrush Um, um, I really want to, I should leave it, it kind of looks like a face with two eyes and like a, a snout or something like that. Just I'm just kind of looking at it, standing back. checking it out. It's very faint over here, very light. I think it's pretty cool. I do like it. But I really want to use my airbrush some more. But I don't want to mess it up. I'm going to torch it. Oh, I'm you guys. 
I think I should leave that. I, I really want to use my airbrush right here, but that actually kind of looks pretty cool. I don't know. I think I'm going to do it. I think I'm going to do it right here. Ugh. I've said to myself that I should just leave it, and I don't. So I didn't do much right there, which is good, because I am going to leave it. It really looks like a face, doesn't it? Like a flaming animal, the eyes here, and the snout. That's pretty cool. So that's it, you guys. I'm done. Done. So, I, I'm going to clean it off here and bring you guys up for a close-up. While I'm doing this, please like and share my videos. Leave comments. If you watch my videos, you know I love comments. Click that subscribe button, please, and hit that bell right next to it, and you will be notified of the next video that I upload. I try to do one every other day. Um, so, yeah. Let me know what you guys think. There's, there is some up here. It's very, very light. Um, very soft. And this is what you would call it. And there's this. But isn't that like a face? I think it's cool. I like it. Actually, since I'm holding it, I'm going to put it over on the dry mat. It's not dripping. No thank. Okay. One second. Okay, you guys. Thank you again for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, please. And, um, I will look forward to seeing you on the next one. Thank you again. Bye.